Hey guys, this is Chris. I'm here from Hollywood Junket. We're here at the Weekend of Horrors in Burbank, California. Today we're here to meet some good people, have a good time, and then... Oh, jeez! Hey guys, this is Chris. I'm at the Weekend of Horrors. I've got Ghostbusters behind us going. Kind of an adapted version. It's awesome. I'm gonna go check inside. We got a bunch of directors, writers, producers, everyone from the horror films for this Halloween. Let's go have fun. We are here today with John Kassir, one of the voices, uh, the voice I should say, from uh, Tales from the Crypt, who we all grew up with, knew and loved, the uh, eerie skeleton. What was Hello, your name? <laughs> the Crypt Keeper. The Crypt Keeper, yeah. No real name, just the Crypt Keeper. CK to my friend. Oh, oh, nice, man. <laughs> working in 3D is the new upcoming thing now. How different is that from working in 2D? I mean, uh, it's it, normally it's no different, but we were using a camera that's never been used before, mm -hmm. so it took 20 minutes to recalibrate the camera every time we relocated the camera. Yeah. So every time you move the camera, it takes 20 minutes. So literally, I had an hour in between every shot, which is bizarre for me. I mean, that's like big budget film. I don't do big budget films, so I got the experience of shooting a big budget film. We shot like one scene a day, which is unheard of. Miss Monster and the Monster Melons. Hey, hey. this is Tad, and this is Tit. He's, he's really partial to peanut butter, and also he likes poop a lot, all yes. sorts of times. From yes. tap, what he thinks are tapioca pudding balls, which yes. they're not, uh -huh. to um, to what else do you normally eat? Tootsie rolls. Tootsie rolls. Yep, and those weren't tootsie rolls from the lizard's butt. Let me see your tootsie rolls. Yeah. look just like tootsie rolls. <laughs> Only a couple inches taller than this. Um, this. Uh, CGI is one more color in the palette of the filmmaker to enhance and, and make uh, use of in, in the best way that it works. I'm, I'm a proponent of old school physical effects. I've done a lot of animatronics, prosthetic makeup effects.